am starting a charity called Princess for a Day, uh, where basically we'll go into uh, hospitals and make little girls feel like princesses. Uh, we have a makeup artist who's going to be doing their hair and makeup and nails, and uh, we're going to give them tiaras and feather boas, because every little girl needs a feather boa, um, and just making them feel special. So I'm heading right now to a meeting where we're going to discuss kind of all the specifics and uh, get the first day on the road. I have no idea what part of town I'm in, but there's not even English words anymore. Well, that says open, but the other stuff? Like, look at this. What does that say? I see tire, but then there's like these other languages. This ma wow! <laughs> Almost hit the mailman. This might actually be uh, what they call Korea Town. Oh, Puppy Castle! Oh, that's about, but it sounds fun. I think this is Korea Town though, because there's um, like characters everywhere. So, and I don't mean people; I mean the language, um, the alphabet. Um, so, I think this is what they call Korea Town. But I've clearly never been in Koreatown before. <laughs> this is so fascinating. Look at all of these. Or <gasps> these not Kansas anymore. This is crazy. Look at this. Like nothing is in English. This is absolutely absurd. Look at all this stuff. And here's what's really crazy. Like, I've lived here for five years. I've never seen this. And this is still L.A., I think. I feel like a tourist in my own city. This stuff, I'm like... And people are looking at me driving by like, what's that girl doing? And I'm guessing that this is Koreatown. Right? I mean, it's got to be. Um, I'm so confused. In Missouri, we don't really have, um, at least I don't know of, like, um, Koreatown, where everything is written in another language. Um, but here's the weird thing also, is that the people that are walking around, they're not Asian. They're mostly Hispanic. So confused. Turn right. Thankfully, I'm almost where I need to go, though. But I am just baffled. I'm going to have to call some friends and figure out where I am. Ah, a familiar sign. We all know and love that. Of course, then again, I could be anywhere. You see those everywhere nowadays. Okay, the car in front of me has a license plate that says something. Can you guess what it is? Ready? I'll give you a moment. I think it means M, whoever M is, loves to accelerate. So they love to go fast, maybe? That car doesn't look like it could go too fast, though, but M loves to accelerate, right? Or my heart to accelerate. I don't know. <laughs> People are looking at me wondering what I'm doing. There's a man just like, what? Okay, I'm turning it off.